This is a game we've all been waiting for. Let's get it over to the guys. I'm tired of waiting. Gus Johnson, Joel Klatt. Like a Hollywood script, Pac-12 title hopes are still alive as Caleb Williams leads USC. Dorian Thompson-Robinson leads UCLA. It's the Crosstown rivalry in prime time. Fox College Football is sponsored by Ram Trucks. Built to serve from the legendary Rose Bowl in Pasadena, California. We've got one of the great rivalries in all of college sports as number seven, USC, travels across town to take on the 16th ranked UCLA Bruins. Hi, everybody. I'm Gus Johnson along with my quarterback, Joel Klatt, and welcome to the Rose Bowl, folks. USC, UCLA. For USC, this may be one of the biggest games they've played in over a decade. With only one loss, this team, if they went out, has a legitimate chance to advance to the college football playoff. Meanwhile, for UCLA, they lost the game. They should have won last week against Arizona right here, but there's a Pac-12 championship still in their sights, and we've got two spectacular quarterbacks that are going to get down today here in Pasadena. This game is these two star quarterbacks, right? And let's start with Caleb Williams. Caleb Williams has put himself right in the middle of the Heisman Trophy race. 3,000 yards throwing the football, 31 touchdowns. But Gus, his best attribute, he does not turn it over. Only those two interceptions, and we know rivalry games can come down to those turnovers. On the other side, you talk about experience. Dorian Thompson Robinson has been playing forever. This is now his 46th start as the UCLA starting quarterback, and he has never been playing better. High efficiency, and when he gets loose, he can hurt you with his legs as well. I know he has been ready for this one for a long time. Now it's time for today's game countdown. Sponsored by Progressive. This is the first top 20 matchup between the Trojans and Bruins since 2005, folks. This could be a great one. Welcome back to Pasadena. USC, UCLA, ready to play here at the Rose Bowl. Time now to join the third member of our team on the sideline, Allison Williams. Hey there, Gus. The question tonight for the Trojans and going forward, what will this offense look like without their leading rusher, Travis Dye? The senior back was injured last week, a career-ending leg injury. And he isn't just their leading back. He is their emotional, their vocal leader, evident as he was carted off the field. The team will now look to Austin Jones, the Stanford transfer, who told me he is ready to step up and play for his injured friend and teammate, but admitted it was a different vibe without Dye at practice this week. He checked in on those guys. Though I actually FaceTimed from the hospital after his surgery on Tuesday, and he is on the sideline here tonight. Lincoln Riley insists they are 1A and 1B as backs. They just went to die more because he was playing so well, but there shouldn't be a big drop off. In fact, Jones may be better at breaking tackles, but the concern, guys, is health. They have to stay healthy at that position now because they just don't have the depth behind Jones. They are talented, but they are young there at running back. Gus. And thank you very much, Allison. UCLA won the toss, deferred. USC will get the ball first. What a perfect night for football here in Pasadena. 66 degrees at kickoff time. This series dates back to 1929. USC leads it. They've won five of the last seven. And tonight, UCLA, USC playing for the victory bet. Last year at the Coliseum, UCLA ambushed the Trojans 62 to 33 in that game. Lincoln Riley in his first year. What a job he's done, especially in the transfer pool. Marvelous job, not only going out and getting the players, but then establishing the culture of a winning program, which they have done in 
quick fashion. On the other side, it's been more of a slow build for UCLA over the five years of Chip Kelly. And Gus, that slow build has been better every single year for the Bruins. And now we see this crosstown rivalry, Gus. This is the best matchup that we've seen in this rivalry since at least 2005. R.J. Lopez ready to send it away for UCLA. Malik Brown is a deep man. Bruins and Trojans, here we go from the Rose Bowl. And that one all the way out of the end zone. That brings on Caleb Williams.